Hello guys. Welcome back to my YouTube channel Desi Astro, PhD in Physics, Astronomy and Astrophysics interview series. Myself, Jyoti Prakash. I am currently a junior research fellow at Inter University Center for Astronomy and Astrophysics, Pune. Started working in field of galaxies evolution and dynamics. I would like to share my PRL, Physical Research Laboratory, Ahmedabad PhD interview experience in astronomy and astrophysics and question asked in the interview. Which might be helpful for other students. Who are futuristic to join Physical Research Laboratory in PhD astronomy and astrophysics program. You can also watch my previous PhD interview video on IISC, IIA Bangalore, IIT Madras, IIT Bombay, RRCAT Indoor, Iowa Kapune Round 1 and Round 2, 2 Ser Pune, HRI Allahabad, RRI Bangalore PhD interview experiences and question asked during the interview. Link has given in the video description. I will also uploading more PhD interview videos on my channel Desi Astro, so please subscribe my channel to stay tuned for quick notification. Physical Research Laboratory, Ahmedabad is very good research institute established by Vakram Sarabhai, where cutting edge research is going with state of art technologies and facilities alum so every area of astronomy and astrophysics. I appeared particularly for interview in astronomy and astrophysics area. My interview went for around 30 to 45 minutes, and interview was unscheduled online via Google Meet. In my interview panel, there were around 4 to 5 professors. When, I joined the interview, they asked me to introduce myself and they asked me about my JRF physics rank, and the area of astronomy and astrophysics I want to work. Whether, I want to work in theoretical or observational astronomy. I said that, I prefer observational astronomy. Then they inquired my MSc projects and other internships. I told them that I have three projects including my MSc projects. They also asked my why I want to pursue PhD in astronomy and astrophysics, if you are an engineer in electrical and electronics. I told that I am very keen to do astrophysics by mistake I landed in field of engineering. Then they asked me about subjects of interest, I told them subjects like classical mechanics, quantum mechanics, electromagnetic theory, mathematical physics are interesting to me. After that, they start bombarding questions on me from different areas. Is it possible to observe different output at different time for the same experiment? Give an example. Perform the following definite delta function integration over all space. What are fundamental and first overtone Cepheid stars? How variable star pulsate? What is mechanism behind it? Draw extinction curve with respect to wavelength lambda. How will you calculate magnitude of a star if it has luminosity L? What do you calculate age of star? How age of star is calculated with period of a variable star? How to calculate flux F falling at Earth in the elemental area from the Sun? Explain why length contracts in special relativity but not in classical relativity? If A plus V E charge plus Q is moving in X direction and magnetic field B in Y direction, in which direction force on charge will act? what will be trajectory of particle. If there are qual number of VE and plus VE charges in a conductor. How net magnetic field in produced during motion. Explain electric and magnetic field from special relativity point of view. This was the end of my interview. Professors ask very good question. In conclusion, the interview at Physical Research Laboratory, Ahmedabad was a very pleasant experience for me too. Professors were quite helpful during the interview. They gave me some insight when I stuck in answering. And they are quite happy with my style to tackle questions. I hope it has helped you to gain some insight into the question asked in PhD interview at PRL, 
and how to prepare for that. Good luck, if you are planning for any such interview. Some of the things you can keep in mind while giving interviews are First Don't give bluff answers to any questions. Second If you don't know the answer to any question just say Sir I don't know. You may ask the next question. Sometimes they ask very difficult questions just to check you how you're proceeding on that questions they don't want you to answer exactly. Third, please be ready to face your MSc project and other internship if you have done. They definitely ask question from your projects. Thanks and good luck for your future endeavor. And don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel Desi Astro. And please press the bell icon to get instant notification. My YouTube channel also teaches you basic of Python programming, Python for astronomy and astrophysics. Soon, I have planned to teach physics for BSc, MSc, and for GATE, JEST and JRFnet exam. Stay tuned for more interview experiences from my friend also. Thank you again.